Hey, it's the Terminion Hero here, and we're playing Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage, not Gateway to Glimmer, because we left Glimmer long ago. We are going to fight Ripto at Ripto's Arena, so let's finish this! Animals. Hey, Shorty. Maybe I can help. What? You again? Yep. If you want to test that power crystal, why don't you try it on me? I'll stand still. I promise. Hmm. I like that idea. Dragon, you've just sealed your fate! Spyro, we want to help you fight Ripto. Elora is using the orbs you collected to store power-up energy. Hunter will throw the powered-up orbs to you as they become ready. Even as we speak, the professor is experimenting with new forms of power-up energy, so you'll soon have abilities that no one has ever seen before. All right, so it looks like everyone's helping us out, and I'm so glad that Zoe showed up there. I wish I would, because, like, I want to make sure that everything gets shown, which means that if I have a failed recording, I'm going to have to come back in, and I make multiple save files. Uh, first of all, my first power up here is supercharge. But yeah, so I've made multiple save files just in case something goes wrong, like me failing at this ridiculously hard boss. Here's Ripto's green move. But... Even when I went to an alternate save file, Zoe still wouldn't show up more than once. So I actually played through the whole game again, and I really wish I would have known that all I had to do was turn the game system off and turn it back on. Anyways, here's Ripto's red move. This fight is really hard to show off, because it's really long and hard and... For a skill point, you gotta beat it without taking damage. And I wanna show all the moves that everyone has. Here's Ripto's blue one, which I'm glad he managed to get, because his blue orbs are like the rarest orbs. Aside from yellow, but we'll have to get those later. So I'm pretty sure we've already seen all three of Ripto's special moves. So I just need to get three green again. I can't believe I got hurt on the first phase of this fight. My goodness. That does not bode well, because the second phase is insane. I mean, it doesn't look too hard to beat, but to beat without getting hurt is ridiculous. So, Super Flame is pretty good if you can hit with it, which is pretty difficult to do. But, it's a lot easier to do if you start out closer to him. Supercharge is alright, but doesn't do a ton of damage. The green power-up is really good against Ripto if you can be up close to him when you do it. Like, you can legitimately get rid of half of his health bar in one use of the green power-up. So I would really like to show that off. But he never gives me green as my last orb. I don't understand why. Also, I know Hunter's supposed to be helping us here, but I feel like he's just hurting us more, because the orbs are always in his... always in Ripto's favor. Wow, how much damage did I deal with that? That was ridiculous. 
if your power-ups get timed out right, you can actually knock his health into the negatives when you land the final hit, which is pretty great. Okay. Second phase. May God have mercy on my soul. Because in all my attempts to do this video, I could not get past this phase without taking damage. And it's a really long phase, too. Because it's just so much harder to get the orbs, because you just don't want to get hurt. And he's, it's really dangerous to get near him. Alright, what's this move? Red. Great. I hate his red move. He shoots out this fire dragon at you, and you gotta run away from it. Which isn't that hard to avoid, and normally... But when he starts shooting at you while you're trying to avoid this dragon, it's ridiculous. Because you want to jump to avoid what he's shooting at you, but if you jump while the fire dragon is following you... Oh, here's his green move, the laser eyes. But yeah, if you jump while the fire dragon is following you, you'll just move too slow, and the fire dragon will catch up to you. And that was a waste of a power-up, because he was shooting at me during that, so I couldn't get near him. My goodness. This is what I mean by this phase being utterly ridiculous. And the thing is, blue orbs are the rarest kind of orbs, and his blue move is the only move that, I, that he uses that I can tolerate. I mean, I'm getting used to the green one now. Oh my gosh, that was super close. Also, I love supercharging into him, although it's a big problem when your supercharge runs out right before you hit him, because then he's almost certainly going to hit you. Hunter, please, thank you. Oh, that, oh, that was my first orb, apparently. Guess I was looking at his orbs. I feel like the red orbs. Oh my gosh, go, go, Spyro, go! Oh my gosh. The red orbs are the best to use against him in this phase. Although the green ones work pretty well when you can actually make them work, but. But the red ones just allow you to attack him from far away which is very much needed. Um, we still haven't seen his blue move. It looks like there's a blue orb here, or is that a red one? That's a red one. I'm getting him down pretty far. I really hope he eats a blue orb next. No, he's going for the green one. Oh, this is gonna get wasted. Yeah, I could tell that was gonna happen. Okay, come and eat the blue orb so we can see your final move. Okay. He just shoots off all these things. Just don't be in the shadows. So that way those things won't land on you. Oh my gosh. 
I want to say this is going really well, but I know I'm about to lose it. Because things just can't go this well for this long. Just sneak behind him while he's getting the other one. Oh no, not the, not the fire dragons. It's all over. Just don't shoot at me. Don't shoot at me. That's right, you collect those orbs and not shoot at me. This is so nerve-wracking. Oh my gosh, he's so close. Oh, if I could have just got one more of those green balls on him, that weird green breath, whatever it is. Hunter, please drop near me. Oh, I just need to get one more attack on him. And this nightmare can most likely be over. Yes! 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 Okay, final phase. I'm not sure what to do here. I'd better not screw this up. Oh my gosh. Okay, super fly and super flame at the same time. Oh man. I am so scared right now, you don't even know. Because I'm pretty sure he can easily hit you on this phase. I don't even know how this phase works. I'm terrified. Just stay away from me, please. Alright, I hit him. I have done damage. It looks like his moves somewhat home in on you, which is terrifying. Try to stay far away. Stay far away. Oh, you can't you can't tell me that that didn't hit him. Maybe try to swerve a little bit too, because if he shoots straight at you and you're going straight, that just seems like it would be a bad time. Okay, I can understand that one missing. Oh man. I am so nervous right now. Oh man, all those went right under him. I gotta get good at aiming this. No! Oh my gosh, that was so close. No! Oh. Please, no. Why can't I hit him ever? Please, just land some hits. Not on me, though. Let me land hits on you. Oh my gosh, that was hits. That's hits. Oh my gosh, it looked like he turned around. I don't know what's happening anymore. I don't think his pattern changes as you go later into this phase, so... If we just keep up whatever the heck it is we're doing, we should be fine. Not that we know what we're doing. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Okay, we're so close. Just let it be over. Yes! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I did it. And that's a skill point too, I didn't take damage. Wow! I don't think we can ever thank you enough, Spyro. 
I suppose you have to go now? Yeah, I'd better. They'll be missing me in the Dragon Worlds, and I've still got a vacation to take. I need it more than ever now. Before you go, I think that Moneybags has something he wants to give you. Hmm, I most certainly do not. Hunter? Spyro, Moneybags is very sorry that he made you pay so much on your way through Avalar. We want you to keep the gems as a reward for helping us. Wow, thanks. Sparks, can you grab them? Let me just type in the new coordinates and... There! Spyro, you can now go to Dragon Shores. Hey, why don't you guys come with me? I bet you could use a holiday. I'm afraid we can't, Spyro. Ripto may be gone, but he caused a lot of damage during his short stay. We'll be cleaning up for weeks. Just remember, though, that you can always get back to Avalar from Dragon Shores if you want to visit. Well, okay. Come on, Sparks. We've got a lot of vacation to catch up on. All right, there we go. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I did it. I didn't hear the skill point noise. I better have got it. Because I did not take damage throughout that fight. If I didn't get that, I'm going to feel very ripped off. <laughs> um, and if that's the case, then I'll just do it off screen. Because I totally did it. Dan Johnson, hey! Anyways, so yeah, that's not it for Spyro 2, because we've still got to go to Dragon Shores for this game's little bonus level. But, man, um, I will be doing Spyro 3, uh, Spyro Year of the Dragon later. But my next game is going to be Ape Escape 2. And I'm going to be doing some other stuff between that. I'm going to be starting Zelda 2 and Metroid 2 soon. Because, again, I'm crazy and I'll actually play Zelda 2. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, and I'll be doing more fan games and multiplayer stuff with Wild Shiny Kirby. But yeah, like I said, we're not done yet. Because we gotta do Dragon Shores. Wow. I still can't believe I made it through that. That was ridiculous. My heart can't take it. So are they going to have some no sheep were harmed in the making of this game or something like Insomniac tends to do? Oh, I want to see this. Or was it just for the first game and then they held off until Ratchet and Clank? Let me see this, come on. No turtles were harmed while we're here, maybe? I want to see that bone guy dance again. Which, like I said, he does make a return in Spyro 3, so be looking forward to that. So will these... these secret agent kids, they're more like ninja kids in the third game, like I said, so that's pretty awesome. It's cool how they just go through all these old places, just kind of to, to remind you all the stuff you went through. Not that I need a reminder, because I just played through this game so many times because of, like, technical issues and a whole bunch of other stuff. But, oh boy. 
And I'm gonna have to play again back up to gulp in order to do my boss bash video. I'll just use my alternate save file to get the Ripto fight. And I already recorded the fight in Metropolis, so... <laughs> Extra special thanks to, we must be getting close to the end. Also, this level, the level where... Uh... Where Agent Zero that connects to Ratchet and Clank was in. And here's Dragon Shores, and a Nork, what? Anyways... So yeah, Dragon Shores, before I end the video, I'll go to the guidebook. We did get our money back from Moneybags, so that is awesome that they forced him to give us our gems back. Uh, we got all 64 orbs. The, li the life count really doesn't matter, because... This LP has been on so many different save files, just so many different playthroughs. Uh... Into the guidebook, we got all the stuff and all the levels, they're all 100%, and now we've got a skill points page. So, Skelos Badlands, all cat... Uh, all cat we got all cacti in Skelos Badlands. We got all the windmills in Huracos. We got perfect in hockey in Colossus. We did three laps of supercharge in Fracture Hills. We we defeated Crush without taking damage. We defeated Gulp without taking damage. We defeated Ripto without taking damage. We rammed into all the trees on Scorch. We beat Ocean Speedway in under a minute and 10 seconds. We beat Metro Speedway in under a minute and 15 seconds. We beat Icy Speedway in under a minute and 15 seconds. We beat Canyon Speedway in under a minute and 10 seconds. We landed on the Idol in Idol Springs. We destroyed all the seaweed in Aquaria Towers. We hit Ripto during the Gulp fight. And we defeated the Cat Bat Quartet in Skelos Badlands. Well done. We got all the skill points. We could press X to see the epilogue, but I'm gonna save that for the very end of the series, so at the end of the next video. So I'm the Terminian Hero, and I will see you then.